Yana, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. I make lifestyle videos, vlogs, post-grad content, and anti-MLM videos. So if that is content that interests you, definitely go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Today's video, I decided it would be fun to do a video about things that TikTok made me buy. I've been binge watching these videos. I think they're so fun to watch and TikTok has been a problem for me because I keep wanting to buy everything when I see someone else buy it. So without any further ado, let's get on into the video. Okay, so I'm gonna start off with clothes and I'll try to link everything in the description in case if you wanna shop it. But the first thing is what I'm wearing right now. So as you guys know, tie-dye has been a huge trend this quarantine with TikTok. But this is a tank top, one of those tank tops from Walmart that's like $2. Um, so it looks like this and I cut it to make it cropped because that's what people have been doing on TikTok. So I definitely want to get more in like solid colors because I think that would be cute. But yes, I got this tank top. It's really cute. It's These are super duper soft. I love them. They literally feel like butter on your skin. And yeah, so definitely check those out at Walmart because those are cute and also with the Walmart trend I saw a bunch of people buy this and wearing it as a tank top it's basically this like really pretty pink tie-dye it looks like a sports bra but it's called the cami or whatever and it is so so cute like look at this and I've seen people wear it with like high-waisted biker shorts or things like that and this was only like ten dollars i think i'm pretty sure but yes it's really really cute they had other patterns as well and it feels like really soft and good materials so i got that i just could not pass this up also with tie-dye tie-dye sets have been huge and i know i'm probably late on this but tiktok made me buy a tie-dye set and i got this from a girl who has her etsy shop i'll put a link to it in the description but this tie-dye set was super affordable it was like 30 dollars, which i have never seen tie-dye sets that cheap usually they're like 50 um but and they're customizable so i chose the colors i wanted i wanted baby pink and baby blue so these are the shorts the super cute pastel blue and pink color and they're so comfy and fit so well. I love this. I love, like, she just hit it on the spot. This is exactly what I, what I wanted, like, baby pink and blue. So this is super cute. I love how light and pastel it is. And you can make yours whatever you want. Um, obviously, whatever colors you want, things like that. But I think this is cute. So that's the bottom. And this is the top. It's cropped. Like, look how cute that is. I know you can tie-dye your own things, but I can never make this look as cute as she does. So I love, love, love this. Like, how cute is that? I've been wearing it a lot. I love the shorts. And I also want to get one that's like a sweatshirt and joggers. But I need to, like, stop shopping because I've been shopping a little too much. The last clothing item has been anything basically by this brand, Stars Above, from Target. I love going on TikTok and TikTok, TikTok and searching up Target finds, whatever, and basically anything from this brand, Stars Above, people buy because it is so soft. So I have a pair of, I have a pair of gray joggers, but these are like a cream. More like an, mm, I would say more like an oatmeal color, but they just look like this. They were $20. I'll have them linked. And guys, I wish you could feel these. These are the softest material I've ever felt in my entire life. Like, I love this brand. I want to buy everything in this brand. And I guess it's affordable. Like, most of the stuff is like $20. I mean, not like extremely affordable, but... I love these so excited to wear them but yeah I want to buy like the whole collection from stars above because it's just so soft and they have like tops and shorts and just really comfy loungewear and you guys have to check it out if you haven't already so love this amazing now on to some beauty products 
So the first thing, I'm sure you guys have seen this, it's the Thayer's Witch Hazel Facial Toner and I have the Cucumber one and I love this stuff, not just because it's been hyped up, but it seriously smells so good. It smells like cucumber. I love putting this on like a cotton round and putting it all over my face. It feels so refreshing and I also use this to clean like behind my ears because I feel like that's like a place that we should be cleaning but we don't you know so i use that um it just feels very gentle on my face and honestly i don't really know if it like does anything specific but it does make my skin feel really refreshed and just i love doing this like before i go to sleep or when I wake up just as like a refresher or after I wash my face, things like that. So I just have the mini, but I will definitely get the full size when I get to it. But love, 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 love this. The next beauty product is the e.l.f. Luminous Putty Primer. I'm sure you guys have seen this everywhere. Um at least on TikTok. Literally, I swear every like Target finds video or Walmart finds, I see the e.l.f. Um, putty primer or whatever. And I've tried this two times and I do really like it. It makes my skin look so dewy with the foundation. I use the L'Oreal Infallible Foundation, which I mentioned in a vlog that'll be in the cards somewhere if you guys want to check that out. Um, I talk about it more but I love this stuff and I'm not like super into makeup I definitely used to be but I have never used a primer and I definitely well I mean I have but not recently and I definitely noticed a difference when I used this I just feel like it made my foundation look so much better my skin had like less bumps and things like that when I put this on so yes got this um you guys probably already have it because it's such a popular product, but I definitely would recommend trying this. I really like it. And the last beauty product is the Airspun Loose Face Powder. This powder I got from Walmart. You can also get it on Amazon. It is super affordable and it just, I just really needed like a, a powder that's like, you know, really does the job. And yeah, it's basically comes with like a puff, you know and i love this and this is just a translucent one i love putting this on um, and baking with it it's just really good for that and i just because my face especially in the summer gets like super oily if i want more of a matte look then i will use this so this is definitely a great translucent powder if you are in the market for one so it is really great and affordable and I love it. The last two things are kind of like lifestyle-y. So the first thing is a book. And yes, TikTok definitely made me buy it and so did some influencers on YouTube. And it is The Last Mrs. Parrish. Oh my gosh, you guys. This book is so good. I could not put it down. And definitely reading during quarantine that's what I've been trying to do a lot lately so I finished this book literally in like two days it was so good like I just could not put this down like it has so many like like at first when you first read it you think it's like one thing like oh like a bunch of like rich women like very kind of like gossip girl kind of style like elite people style and then boom stuff happens and you're like what the heck it is really great so if you're looking for a great beach read it goes by super quickly it's um I would say what genre would this be I guess in like a thriller kind of I don't I don't know but it's very very good there's romance in it or it's crazy twists and turns in it so definitely get this book if you're looking for something to read it is worth the hype I promise and at first I was like mm, can it be that good but yes it's really really good so definitely check that out especially when you get towards the end like whoo it gets it gets crazy like my jaw drops but love this book it's such a good read and the last thing that TikTok made me buy is also like the most expensive one but to me it was worth it so it is the, this ring light tripod stand so it has a tripod for your phone 
um and then a ring light and it's like dimmable and it has like three different settings like you can make it more a cool toned warm toned or like a in between and it also comes with a remote and it stands up like pretty tall like you can make it go taller and it comes with a remote so you can just put your phone on it press the remote and make a photo shoot i've used this for my youtube videos as well and i love it i just think it takes your instagram and your selfie game to like the next level so it is really great and if you are making youtube videos and you don't want to invest in like a full-on ring light i feel like that's a good place to spread to the i feel like that's a good place to start especially if you're starting out and filming with your phone or something you can easily put your phone on there or what i do is i just have my camera on a tripod and then i have this behind it and it's really good so definitely recommend that alicia marie definitely influenced me to buy this but so did tiktok but yes it is really great and i highly recommend it Alright you guys, so those were all the things that TikTok made me buy and TikTok probably will make me buy more stuff if I'm being honest. So if you guys want another video like this or maybe an Amazon favorites video or something like that, definitely leave a comment down below. And thank you guys so much for watching and supporting me and I'll catch you all in my next video. Bye guys!